First John three three. Kai, pas ha echon tain elpida, tautain, ep alto hognize ha altan, kathos ekenas hognas esten. Translation and pas ha echon is everyone who has right. Ha echon is your that is your participle, your substantive use of the participle. And it's modified by the adjective pas, every. So ha echon is the one who has, and pas ha echon, everyone who has. Then afterwards, we have this direct object of the participle. Everyone who has hope, and not just hope, but this hope on him, that is this hope on Christ and his return, hagnidze purifies ha'altan. That's the reflexive pronoun there, ha'altan, purifies himself, kathos, just as ekenos, that one, is pure. It's interesting, isn't it, in John's writings, how he likes to use the demonstrative pronoun ekenos or hutas to refer to people. He has his preference for the demonstrative rather than the personal pronoun ekenos which is that, or that one, or in the plural those, versus hutas, this, or this one, or these. Ekenos is called the far demonstrative pronoun, and hutas is labeled the near demonstrative pronoun. It's called demon the demonstrative pronoun from the Latin demonstro, which means to point out.